I remember I did hit pan on this one while I'm in inside our car waiting for my kids because they're taking naps. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and for today's video, I'm going to do a declutter video. So if you guys are interested for this kind of video, then just keep on watching. So for those of you new to my channel, my name is Princess and I do a lot of beauty content. So for today, I'm going to do a declutter. Uh, I'm going to declutter the ones that I don't use, the ones that are expired. I'm going to either throw them away if they are expired or if they're still good i'm going to pass it along to my family yeah let's go start it so first these are the products that i took off on my makeup collection these are already like already um i did use them and they are already um bad and then i'm going to show you guys this one right here this one is already expired it isn't already this is an old um foundation that i really like and this is the wet and wild photo focus golden beige um shade and i really like this um formula the texture and the um finish but unfortunately um it is already expired and i am going to repurchase this one and then um this one right here this is the um elf cosmetics uh, poreless potty primer and this is already like old one and i didn't really use it much and i'm not going to repurchase this one because um i don't really gravitate on this uh putty primer but although i'm going to repurchase the buff buff primer that's the one i really like and then this one right here this is the ulta beauty um clear brow gel that i got from the advent calendar last year and finally it is empty and then this um mascaras um this one i really like from uh, maybelline um sky high mascara i preferred this one compared to the um other one which is i forgot what it is but I prefer this one. I like this one. I will repurchase this one. And then this one though, I will not going to buy this e.l.f. Cosmetics um, Big Mood Mascara. I really don't like it. I prefer this Wet n Wild Big Papa uh, Mascara from Wet n Wild. And then this is one of my favorite mascara from e.l.f. Uh, from <laughs> this is one of my favorite mascara from ColourPop um more than the um their first uh mascara which are the bff this one is actually a defining like more um volumizing mascara that i did like and i actually have the backup that i already opened recently so if i have time to repurchase again i will repurchase this mascara from them and this one it is the um l'oreal infallible full wear um concealer it is expired already and i have the shade 365 um cashew i'm just showing this um shade for you guys more on my um record because if i really wanted to repurchase this one i can just go back here and check it out what shade i have but unfortunately this is already expired i am going to repurchase this one because i really like the finish in here and then lastly is this one this is the color pop lip stain this is their um all glossy lip stain uh, fresh kiss um for some reason i don't like the smell of this one i feel like it is already like not good so i am going to declutter this so Yeah, these are the products that I'm going to declutter first. And now let's move on to the uh, drawers over here. So first, I do have the um, liquid eyeliners here. The gel liners from Colourpop and other liners I have. And then my brow stuff. So first I have here are the brow stuff. I am going to declutter this one. This is from Elf Cosmetics. Um I believe this is like a bite size um mini brow magic one. Uh, first because of um the smell. It is like kinda 
stinky right here although these ones are good but i will declutter this one i prefer the pencil over this one uh as you guys can see i have a little bit of um trouble using this wax here so I'll first declutter and then i am going to declutter this um mascara this is the la colors um i use this one for my brows because it's clear but unfortunately this is um already um expired so i'm going to declare that and then the rest i'm still working on and i am going to keep this this is the deep brow from anastasia and then recently i did use this um wax from ColourPop. i like it so i'm going to keep it over here are my liquid liners so first i am going to declare is this bff color pop liquid liner this is already old so i'm going to declare that and then most of these are new um i am still working on this maybelline one um these are only fresh new and then over here i am not going to declutter any of this because they are new and um for some reason, liners are easy to um, use, but for now, I'm going to keep this. So I have this three over here. Moving on on this drawer, these are like mascaras that I have. So this is new from Tarte. This is the Light Camera Lashes. Ilya, Ilya Say, and then rare beauty that i haven't used yet and then this is the new um fresh open color pop act natural mascara and then this one this is the la colors mascara waterproof that i am going to declutter because it's already dry and then over here that i'm going i'm not going to declutter any of this because these are new these are the Perfusion Liquid um, Eyeshadows. And then these are my glitter, like, glitter eyeshadows from e.l.f. They are new. And then nothing here to do the powder because some of these are new still. So, and then over here, these are like kind of... Uh, cream buttercream gel liner from a studio like chapman's a um this one i started to use them although they are kind of dry and i mix them with um kind of setting spray or uh face oil so they're still working and then over here are my single eyeshadows so and then the duos from the um ultra beauty advent calendar and then i do have this one's right here this is are the pigments from you can be and then i still have this um hydro liner and then this one i don't know what it is but i'm going to declutter because i'm not sure what is this so declutter let's move on over here and i do have the what do you call this? The Vanessa Myricks um, Rose Dream Trio. They are really good. I like them. But over here, I am going to declutter this one. This is the Matte Eye Primer from Ulta Beauty. It is already dry. And then this one also. This is the Elf Cosmetics um, Smudge Pot that I don't really use. So I'm going to take this off. And then this two right here, a tacky base and a glow base that I don't know. But I'm going to declutter these two. I'm going to keep this one because it's not open yet. So I only have two over here. And then this ones right here are from um, Olap. These are like cream color eyeshadows. So I'm going to keep all of them. So let's move on in this drawer right here. These are like my blush, um, bronzer, contour. So 
I am going to fix this so that you guys can see all this stuff here. Okay, let's start on the very bottom. So here they are. These are my bronzers right here. Um, there. Better. This one's better. So first, I'm going to declare this one. This is the A L'Oreal Paris True Match Lumi Bronze. I really love this one, but um, recently I did put this one on my shop my stash, but it is kind of smelly now. Although I am going to repurchase this one because I really like the um, shade. Um, this is in the shade of Sun Kiss Glow medium number two so the clutter and then i'm going to keep this two face because i like this one and then this one although this one is finishing pressed powder from shop miss a i really like this one because it is not really orangey it is like more on a true kind of bronzer color <laughs> And then this one, I really like this one. I did put this one on my um, Project 10 uses and I discovered that I really like this one. Especially, it says here it is a waterproof bronzing powder. So, um, this is how it looks like. It is not really a colorful thingy, but it gives me that kind of sun-kissed glow. And then this one, this is new. This is the Physician's Formula Butter Coffee Bronzer. This is the um, coffee edition. I think it's coffee or cake, I don't know. But this is in the shade Latte. And I always say this. I always say this one. Um, it looks like the, uh, the house poly pockets. <laughs> so this one, it is really nice. It's like same as the um Rimmel one and it smells good and then recently i did purchase this rare beauty uh bronzer stick i really like this one and it melts to my skin that's why i like it and although i like the rare beauty one i am going to declutter this this is the next bright idea illuminating stick and it's in the shade of sandy glow this is already like old so i am going to and it's starting to smell bad too so that's why i'm going to declutter so i only have four so far four um bronzer powder here and one here so um for now i'm going to put them over here i still have i have new I have new bronzers that I'm going to put in here later on so okay let's move on on this container right here these are like my liquid serum um, stick blush so first I am going to declutter this one this is the um, next bright idea blush and it's in the shade of brick red blaze yeah um, I'm going to declutter this one because of the smell and I believe these are already discontinued so I am going to declutter it and then this one I'm going to keep because I like although this one is not my go-to blush I like it because it does have a strong magnet in here that I use every time I depotted my ColourPop eyeshadows and then I am going to keep this two right here. These are the Cheek um, Dew from ColourPop. I have in the shade Sour Cherry and Passion Flower. And then I do have two Rare Beauty um, uh, blush in here. I have in the shade Love and Joy. So keep this okay let's move on on this one i'm going to take this out first so that you guys can see how is this Come on. okay first i am going to declutter this two over here these are the aries studio blush um 
I didn't use at all of this tool this year. So I have in the shade Kindle or Kiddle and Wispy. Um, I am going to declutter this one because I prefer the cream one compared to this two. Declutter this. And then, like I said, I am going to keep this one for now. These are the Hush Cream Sheer Blush from AU Studio from Shot Miss A. Um, although, I am going to declutter this one right here. I don't really use this one. This is in the shade of Charm. As you guys can see, it is really orangey. I don't really use some of this. So, wait. Okay. Never mind. I'm going to keep this one because I wanted to challenge myself to use this um, shade of um, blush. Um, and it is really cool to have it in spring to summer, I guess. So keep it. Keep this. And then I'm going to keep this color pop. Drag me crazy. Super chalk cheek. <laughs> And then and I'm going to declutter this Ulta Beauty blush in here because I don't really use this shade here. It is really pink and I don't like this one. So declutter. Over here, I do have this beauty blender in the shade um cheeky pink i don't know about this because it is pink and normally i don't wear pink um blush i'm going to put this on um maybe pile for now and then for this one i am going to keep this one this is in the shade red brick i think brick red so I'm going to keep this and then keep this one. This is new. This is the Physician's Formula Butter Blush and it's in the shade Mauve Matte. I like it because how beautiful is this? <laughs> and then I am going to keep this Elf Cosmetics right here. This is in the shade Brilliant Mauve. And then keep this Rimmel London one, keep this Physician's Formula. I am going to keep this Covergirl Cheapers in the shade of Pretty Peach. And then I'm going to keep this NARS color. I'm going to keep this Elf one. Keep this one. I believe this is Blushing Rose. And this is in Berry Mary. But I am going to declutter this one. This is in the rosy blush because of um I didn't use this one at all this year. So take it out. Um that one is the one that I did um save on my last declutter, but after that I didn't really use it at all. So I am going to clutter it now. Then I have my two back trips here. And then keep this. Keep this. And then I'm going to keep this. I like this one. This is the Elf Cosmetics. Um, I think these are the Cheeky Glow. So, and then let's move on to this one i am going to keep this sephora trio palette i'm going to keep the zuri flawless um face contouring and highlighting kit but this one i am going to declutter because i don't really use this one especially this three right here the powders although um this one is already uh discontinued in shop miss a2 and then these are um, single blush that I'm going to keep. And then I do have this ones right here. This is the quads like cheek palette from 
uh, color pop. These are new, so I'm going to keep them. This is the um, such a rush and sweet roll. Keep them, and then I'm going to declutter this one already because these are already discontinued anyway. And then I'm going to keep this BH Vanilla Cream Truffle Black Palette. I really like this one. Really, really like this one. <laughs> um, so keep it. And then let's go back to the... Um, did I say that I'm going to keep this? I think I did keep it. So keep it. And then I'm going to declutter this one. This is the Ulta Beauty Blush one and keep this Beauty Blender one. This one, it is my um, highlighter container that's here from um, Perfusion um, Blush and Glow. I'm going to keep this one. Uh, I'm going to keep this one also. This is the um, Revolution Makeup um, Revolution um, Selfie X um, collaboration. So keep this. And then I'm going to keep my three... Uh, this palette here and then this one right here are my highlighters I'm going to put this down for now there. I'm going to keep this one this is the Ofra uh, highlighter Star Island and then I'm going to keep this one also from Elle Cosmetics this is the collaboration with hard defensor this already discontinued but i really like this one so keeping this one i believe this is only um highlighter i have from elk cosmetics surprisingly and then i do have this ava studio press highlighter in the shade refine and then i do have two fenty beauty um highlighter duos i do have the sand castle and mojito and Mimosa and Sangria. I haven't used this one yet. So I would love to use it this coming um, 2023. Although this one I really like. This too. And then I'm going to keep this Coringo Highlighter Duo. Uh, I believe this is the only um, K-Beauty that I have in here. And then I do have this Ofra in the shade um, Rodeo Drive. And then keeping this too, this is the Hogwarts from Ulta Beauty Harry Potter. And I do have this ColourPop in the shade Hippo. Keep this too. And then I'm going to keep this um, Po Highlighter from A Studio in the shade of Nebula. Rare Beauty um, in the shade Mesmerize, but I am going to declutter this too because I really don't use liquid highlighters anymore. So declutter this too. Over here are my uh, super short shadows, but I'm not going to declutter any of this because I will have to revive them now. <laughs> And then here are my um, my foundation. So I'm going to declutter this. This is the Revlon Color Stay Full Cover Matte um, Foundation that I don't really use at all. So I'm going to declutter this. And then this one, I am going to 
declutter this because I don't really use this at all. I tried a lot of more times. This is the Tom Ford um, Shade on Luminate Soft Radiance Foundation. And it is actually too dark for me. That's why I'm going to declutter it also. The rest, the rest I'm going to keep because most of these are new. So, and over here are my setting sprays and some of my uh, primers. So first, I'm going to declutter this um, Elf Cosmetics Jelly Pop. Uh, this is the Dew Primer. Um, I like this one compared to the other ones. Um, although, but but this one is already like old, so I am going to declutter it. But I will repurchase this one, and then I am just going to declutter this um, sunshine stick from Tarte because I really don't know what it is, and then declutter this too because they are already old. And then declutter this. This is the NYX um, Honey Do Me Up. I tried to use this one this year, but I just couldn't use it much at all. So I declutter it. And pretty much, I think that's it for this container. Let's move on over here. So these are the powders. I am going to declutter this one over here. This is the Maybelline full coverage um, powder foundation i tried to keep this one but this year i didn't use it at all so i'm going to declutter this and then i am going to declutter this elf cosmetics hd powder um this is in the soft luminance i don't know if this is still in their website um i don't know but i'm going to declutter this because of i prefer using this still this is the um, HD powder. Um, it is in the clear. I like using this one more than this one. So, the clutter. And then, the rest I'm going to keep. Let's move on over here. These are the concealers and some of the um, fake lashes I have. I'm going to keep all of this here because as you guys can see, I don't have enough um, fake lashes anymore because I use most of them. So first, I am going to declutter this three um, concealer from AV Studio because they are stinky now. <laughs> um, although, I am going to repurchase the I believe it's the nude or the buff this is too light for me i believe i'm going to let me see yes i am going to repurchase the buff because the um nude it is much more of a peach color and then the buff it's much more lighter so i'm going to repurchase the buff instead and then declutter this three and then i am going to keep the rest over here because these are new this is new although i don't like it <laughs> i prefer this one and then i like this one too these two are new, so I'm going to keep this Anastasia Beverly Hills in the shade number 8. And then the Dior one, so that's over here. These two are my um, samples and uh, new stuff. That's why I am actually declutter my stuff here because of um, it is overflowing already. These two, I don't have enough space. So, I am going to put other stuff in my new containers here. Um, let's move on over here, which are my um, small eyeshadow palettes. Okay. Over here. Let's move over here. Move a little bit. There you go. 
So first, I am going to declutter this one. This is from Sephora um, Ice Stories palette. They're okay, but I don't really did really well me a lot. So I'm going to declutter this, and then I am going to declutter this for a blonde. Uh, cream shadow although I am going to put this on the side because um, this is one of the eyeshadow palette that I have on my pen those eyeshadows that I am going to um, to do a video uh, this week or next week um, this is in the wild orchids those ones are really good but um, I prefer using them like a, a top not topper a base because they're not really that pigmented they are really sheer sheer so um although um it, it's already old so i'm going to declutter this but um i like the um finish of this one um so I'll declutter this i'm going to keep this one though this is the um revlon so fierce palette in the um slight flex because they are really good this ones although they're too dry but I like them so much because they are kind of bling bling <laughs> so keep this um, I don't know about this though this is uh, Ota Beauty one that I got for free because I wanted to keep it because of this three over here and then two, this two you know what I'm going to keep it because <laughs> I like it and then I am going to declutter this two over here these are the um, hard candy eyeshadow palette that I did buy last year um, these are new I didn't touch them um, this is the guilty Ple uh, pleasure uh, blush full of nudes I'm going to declutter this um, this one though I am going to keep it for now because um, these three are one of the shadows that I did put on my Pandos eyeshadows. And then I'm going to keep this one. This is the Wet n Wild, um, not a basic peach. Peach. <laughs> and then I'm going to keep all of my, um, all of my Miss A over here. And then I'm going to keep this one. This is the Ultimate Queen. This is new from NYX. And then this one too. And then I do have two more of Wet and Wild here. And then I'm going to keep the only Kaja Mento uh, palette I have. And then I'm going to keep this Huda Beauty I have in here because I like them. And then I'm going to keep this two over here. This one's over here. This is the um, pop quads I have. Um, I have the Leo, um, Taurus, and Libra. That. And then these are my mini Natasha Nona ones. I am going to keep. And then I do have this Dunkin' Donuts. Um, elf cosmetics that I'm going to keep because they are kind of collectibles <laughs> although this one it doesn't really come out but I am trying to uh, make a plan to use this accordingly but for now I'm going to keep them from elf but i am going to declutter this one this is the um bite size pumpkin pie because the shadows here don't really come out the way they used to be so i'm going to declutter this then i'm going to keep this one this is the um very bad though then I'm still going to keep this in my studio once. So it's kind of hectic 
go with it. And then over here are just my um, single eyeshadows. So I'm going to keep all of them though. Now let's move on to the eyeshadows um, palettes over here. So here are the kind of small, medium, large palettes. Um, there are like BH Cosmetics here, Colourpop here, some of the other ones, um, small palettes, and then my uh, Beauty Bay ones and my Juvia's Place. So first, I am going to declutter this one over here. This is the Nubian Tube by Juvia's Place. Um, it is already old, that's why I'm going to declutter it. And because I wanted to declutter it because this one, it keeps me not using the other palettes I have because how good it is. Um, although I'm going to still keep it in my pile because this is one of the palettes I have on my Pandos eyeshadows. So I need to say goodbye on this one. <laughs> And then I'm going to keep this three because they are fairly new. New, new. And then this is the By Beauty. IBY Beauty. It is still new. New. And I'm going to keep this um, Amuse Cosmetics palette though. And then I am going to declutter this 9X Little Extra from Morphe because after I did buy this one last year, I didn't use it at all so I'm going to pass it along and then I am going to declutter this Tarte palette here that I did get from my BoxyCharm this is in the Sunrise Amazon clay eyeshadow palette I am going to declutter this and then pass it along because I don't like it <laughs> and then I don't know about this this is the Maybelline soda pop um, palette I am going to put this one on my maybe piles for now and then the rest I am going to declutter this this is the cherry crush from color pop because um, I already have a new I have this one over here so it's like kind of backup so I'm going to declutter this and give it away come on come on and then this is like kind of my old old one my very very first 12 pen from color pot this is the she palette from femme rosa or karuchi and as you guys can see how it is I am going to declutter this. Um, I'm going to put this on my um, treasure box because um, it is really nice palette for me, especially the um, it is my first tool pan for from ColourPop, and I love the shades here. But it is already old eyeshadow, so I'm going to um, declutter it and then move it to my treasure box. And let's move on to the bottom part. So most of the eyeshadows here are new. Most of them are new. Uh, I'm not going to declutter any over here. But I am going to take this out. This is the Amuse Cosmetics um, palette. Um, I kept it, but other than that, I didn't use it at all. So I'm going to declutter this. And... I believe this is the only palette that I will declutter on this section. So now let's move on to the lip products. I have a lot of it here that I am going to declutter. So first, I'm going to show you guys this one. I did put my um, nice packaging here uh, because of um, I wanted to... Um, fill this out and it came out good but later on I am going to fix this one still because I have a new um, lipsticks here on the um, 
my containers over here so um, these are the ones i'm going to keep now let's move on to my container which is this one right here so first here they are i don't know if i'm going to declutter over here because most of these are new so skip this one so let's move on over here though i don't know if i'm going to keep this one i'm going to put this one on the maybe um pile these are the of cosmetics ones i believe these are already discontinued so maybe and then over here i am going to clutter this too these are the seriously um satin lipstick that i don't really use at all um i have in the shade pepper and raspberry so i decluttered this and then i do have this one over here this is the zoeva powerful lip twist i am going to declutter this because i don't really use this at all i prefer this ones these are the two makeup revolution ones i believe these are already discontinued i do have this super clicky nyx um discontinued and this i believe this one is still there this is the um super stay ink crayon in the shade of um change is good from maybelline so keep this i am going to declutter this this is the all made treat yourself um i don't really use them at all so might as well declutter it and then the rest i am going to keep and then over here these are like my um more maybelline products i am going to finally declutter my super stay matte ink lipsticks because these ones are moving to my lips so um i'm going to declutter them and then i am going to keep this three this is the voyager voyager um ruler and then pioneer because these are really new but i am going to um declutter this um spice for me because i didn't really use this one at all and it's starting to smell bad so declutter then i do have this rich ruby i'm going to keep because this one it is really nice red color and this one is new this is the touch of spice i repurchased this one this year so I'll keep it and then this one is the raging raisin i am going to keep still good and then brown blush I'm going to keep and then i do have toasted truffle keep it and then this is in red revival i am going to declutter because i don't really use this much so i'm going to so i'm going to keep this five of them and then lastly i do have this one the vinyl ones so I'm going to declutter this elf cosmetics modern metals already and then i'm going to declutter this three from next because i don't really use this three and then keep this nice over here these are deluxe velvet from color pop and then these ones are new so keep them so what I'm going to do is 
this here. This here. I am going to keep this one here. These are my macarons. Mars. And then this one. Nope. And this one is. Actually, I'm going to grab this one over here, over in here. And then, um, I am going. I am going to declutter this for color pop. Um, I believe these are the the first ones. Um, Lux lipstick here, and then this one. It is the um, second one, which is the matte one these three are cream so i'm going to declutter this four and then i'm going to keep the rest i only have six of them so far so i am going to put them in this container so that I know that I'm going to use them. And then I am going to keep the... Actually, not going to keep the elf one. I'm going to declutter this too. And yeah. And then I went back to the other basket I have over there. I'm going to declutter this to Super Stay Matte Ink from Maybelline. This is in the shade of um, Amazonian and Fighter. These are already old, so I'm going to repurchase some of the Super um, Super Stay Ink from Maybelline that I like. But this one, I have to take them out and then i am going to keep this one though this is the maybelline soda pop palette so these are the eyeshadow palettes that i did declutter um like i said some of them that i'm going to keep because i'm still putting them in my um, finale for my pandos eyeshadows but so far i have two four seven ten eleven that i decluttered so I am going to put them here and then these are the um, other products that I decluttered so these are not much but still I have um, extra space now for my new products my makeup products that I wanted to use and that's it for you guys I hope you guys like this video please give this a thumbs up and see you on my next video. Bye.